Hi, I'm Josh. I'm Ollie. And we just got back from jolly New Zealand. Again. Again? Oh yeah! A couple of months ago, we got an email from 20th Century Fox. They said they are in the process of making this new film based on a manga called Alita Battle Angel. Same producer as Avatar. Same director as Sin City and Spy Kids. <laughs> no, those two are uh, very similar. <laughs> <laughs> and they're producing it in collaboration with Weta Studios in New Zealand. Basically any big CG film in the last 20 years, Weta have been involved yeah. in. They literally are like the kings of CG. They made Lord of the Rings, they made Avatar, they made Marvel movies. Anyway, 20th Century Fox said we want you to come and see how we're making Alita Battle Angel because we're making all these like advancements in technology. So this film is a mixture between live action and performance capture and it was performance capture that they were particularly interested in showing us. And I was excited because yeah. I want to get in a Velcro grey suit yeah, I've, covered I've in seen ping pong suits, balls right? and be made into Andy Serkis. When it, what? <laughs> he's Gollum. He's, 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 he's the made OG. into other stuff. You're he's, not going to be made into well, him. You could be. A CG That's the version power of the computer. Of him. Yeah. <sighs> it honestly was one of the craziest experiences of my life. Absolutely we nuts. weren't allowed to film like 90% uh, of yeah. the stuff we did there because it's like super top secret. I was like, why are you Basically, bringing us here? We're anywhere not to film. in Weta, they were like, no cameras, Can't film here. no cameras. So it might be a little bit like staccato going from like activity to activity, but we just had the most amazing time. So without further ado, here is a little taste of the inside of Weta and Alita Battle Angel. When we arrived in Wellington, we went straight to Weta to take a look at how far CG in films has come since Avatar. This is professional, man. This is like the home of CG. We are out of our league. Right we're all we are so out of our league. I'm excited. We're going to try on a real performance capture outfit and do a scene. I am not a good actor, but who knows? Maybe I'll be able to fool Robert into casting. <laughs> <laughs> so today, guys, <clears throat> you're going to have 53 markers on you. They wow. are rubber. There's no electronics or sensors in them or anything. It's just okay. a piece of rubber with reflective tape. 84 cameras with infrared lip ring lights shoot light out, one camera sees that coming straight back to it, it tracks it in the 2D, up, down, left and right. We do a process in the morning called calibrating, which basically lets the cameras work out where they are in relationship to each other. Okay. Once they know that, we can track this in a 3D environment. Wow, amazing. How do you even begin to get into character? Well, I already feel part cyborg. Do you? But I feel like I should move along like a robot. Yeah, <laughs> that's not what they're oh, looking they're for though. Like an idiot. <laughs> oh, no, I'm already embarrassing myself in front of no one. All right, well next up, We've got to get scaled. Whoa. So, this is the scaling volume, and we're basically going to scale Jin Man, who's a digital character's proportion to okay. match you. Okay. We're going to do a T pose. Okay. There yeah. you go, is dots. So, he's numbering Whoa. them out at 153. Those correspond to. It's Mr. Jin Man. Oh, my mind is flown. <laughs> Technology, Ollie. Technology. <laughs> Look, Ollie, stop messing around. We need to take this seriously. We want to meet the director of the film. <laughs> All right, Ollie, come on. You've had enough fun. You've had your fun. Come on. Great. All right, those. Come on in and meet okay. Mike. Oh. Amazing. Hi, Josh and Ollie. Hi, Mike. Hey, guys. Oh, this is hi. Eric. Nice oh, to see you. Nice to see you, Eric. Nice this is Alan oh, and Alan. 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 wearing the same thing. And I, I know. <laughs> <laughs> you guys should have got the memo. The text went round. Yeah. 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 And this is Robert. Oh, wow. Hey. Oh, that's lovely to meet you, Josh. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. I'll be on set director and minstrel. We'll be playing some musical accompaniment for your action scene. Oh, wow. wow. Fantastic. Just get you in the mood. <laughs> so on the monitor next to Robert, you can see the virtual set that we've built. Ike way in the back waving his hand. He's playing Romo. And as he moves around in the environment, he can interact with the environment and it gives him a space to perform in. All these 80 cameras that are in here have to be able to see you as you're walking through the set so we can capture up to 15 people at a time. You can see actually what he looks like coming through there live and as... Oh my goodness. Is that cool? 
So he's playing like 10 foot Gruishka. So that's um, why he's looking down at the floor right now, because that's the only way to line up his eye uh, line to that guy. That's how tall he is. In the virtual set, when Ike he's hits playing. that pad, he's actually hitting oh, uh, Alan. Um, we've also got the blue mark up there, which is Ike's eye line. So he's looking and, and also swinging at that mark up there, and that's hitting Alan in the head. And we line it back up in 3D space. So wow. today, we're gonna just do a little bit of choreography. How's that sound? That sounds sounds incredible. incredible. Well, we'll, we'll see. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Here, we'll give you a, your weapons. <laughs> um, this is crazy. Yeah. And you can interact with things. Whoa! Oh my goodness. <laughs> a lot of catch. Good luck. Yeah, with your blades. <laughs> oh, oh, well done. <laughs> yeah, there you go. <laughs> okay. So what we're going to have you do is do a big haymaker right. Okay. Passing through this blue ball's line. Well, then we're going to kick him right in the kneecap. Well, that'll take him down. When he's down, throw that rock right at the X again. Just like. Oh, rock's my yeah. one weakness. So when he's down, <laughs> down this eye line is good for him. Amazing. Amazing. All right. Yeah. You guys ready? And action. <sighs> what a nice day for a walk. Yeah. Nothing's it's, uh, it's kind of a creepy place, Ollie. <laughs> I think we're safe. Yeah. There's no one around here. Really? Yeah, we're all good. Whoa. Oh my god! Peekaboo! Ha ha! Come on! Ah. Ah. Yeah! Get him! Ah. Get him! Idiot! <laughs> uh, one, one last kick! <laughs> yeah, high five. <laughs> yeah. And cut. Excellent, okay. well done. I love the All right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. You get really into it, don't you? And the sound effects ha really help. Yeah, <laughs> So have a look. Oh, this there you are. You can see it. Look at the blades up. Look, sound. Yeah, it's... yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah oh. oh, that's a good one. Nice. Isn't that crazy? Yeah. I mean, that he's over there and that you're here, but the contact. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's incredible. And you know, we can adjust that later post if okay. we need sure. to. But a lot of times they hit it, it's yeah. great. Yeah. Now that we got a great performance of you guys, you guys go away. Mm -hmm. And I can come and I can shoot this for a month. I can come get close ups of your eyes, with your feet. Because I already got your performance. Oh, so the whole again. thing is captured wow. and then you can move it anywhere. I can put it yeah. anywhere. Yeah. Yep. So, uh, so, so we can play that back. we're kind of just watching it to kind of see if we got the performance. Wow. Wow. As a director with that many options available to you, is that not harder? Like, when, when do you know when to stop? Well, sometimes you'll predetermine your shots based on the script okay, and the scene. Okay. Sure. Yeah. Here I can determine all my shots now based on your performance, which yeah, is better. Okay, now okay, I'm not yeah. trying to shoehorn you guys into some pre-laid plan that's right. just kind of really pulled yeah. out of a hat. Now I can go, oh, I like the way you guys interacted. Now I'm going to shoot it differently yeah. than I would have if we had to do all of that on the same day. So uh -huh. for me as a director, it frees me up a lot to base it more on the, the magic of the performances. Well, incredible. So, that is cool. Cool. And you guys yeah. have to worry about everything we else. Have to worry about <laughs> 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 thanks so much for Oh, thanks for really? coming, you guys. Have a great day. Yeah, yeah. thank you. Yeah. You too. Cool. Nice meeting you guys. Nice to meet you. Absolute cool. pleasure. Yeah. That was one of the most surreal experiences of my entire life. I am blown away. That was cool. That I just want to do so this. Cool. Let's quit. Let's quit YouTube and do this all day. I want to throw rocks at giants. <laughs> <laughs> We then got a chance to interview Rosa Salazar, who plays Alita, who this film is literally all about. Hi, I'm Hi, Rosh. I'm Rosa. <laughs> nice, to nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Hi, Ollie. Just wanted to say, from the get-go, we're huge fans of the Maze Runner series. Yes. In front of you in the Maze Runner series. Thank and you. And it was huge in South Korea as well. Yes, it was. It's and we're excited to see you as Alita. Here she is. This is amazing. I mean, what <laughs> we've seen so far has been kind of mind-blowing. But we just tried out the performance capture stuff, mm -hmm. and that was crazy. How'd you like it? Sweaty. It was. Yes, it was, sweaty. <laughs> was this your first time doing a film in? performance capture. Yes, I love how well you've been trained by John Landau because I have, you haven't once said motion capture. It was just a performance capture. Yeah. It was my first time in performance okay. capture. Okay, uh, but I'm a, I was a big fan of Andy Serkis. Yeah. I'm a big fan of Weta. I had been a big fan of them for a long time. So mm. I was really excited to get into the suit. This suit is a lot tighter than the ones that you had. It's yeah. 
suctioned like, okay. to your body. And then you have a oh battery pack goodness. and a microphone yeah. and a recorder on your head and uh, the cables run down the back of your head and connect to a battery pack and a fan and a recorder on your wow. back. So and you are your... already a cyborg. Yeah, you can see, yeah, you're exactly, like, you're, exactly. You're not yeah. acting even. It's no, I don't even met an actor who's <laughs> picking me up out of the street. <laughs> just like Alita out of the rubble. Wow. <laughs> Was it like a barrier to getting into character? Like compared to a conventional movie when you're in a normal costume, did you find that? Hey. Difficult? You know what? Actually, in, it helped because you get into the suit, as you know, it neutralizes you for you to create whatever you want to create. I mean, also, I'm in my 30s, so to be able to play a character who's 14, I mean, only could that be done with performance capture. Mm, when you see the blank. final clips, it's obviously so much has gone on from the initial performance to the, the final piece. Right. Do you recognize your performance in there, or is there just that, that slight bit added on? Are there that moments like that it? you're like... It's so good. Yeah? <laughs> it is feels it? so great. Well, when I first saw it, I went, that's me. I was sort of sh shocked, yeah. and uh, John's like, yeah, you like it, you like it. <laughs> and I couldn't yeah. stop saying, that's me. There was a lot of uh, shock and awe when I first mm. saw it. But to answer your question, it's like, actually, when I see what, they, what they've cut together and I see the final product, I go, oh, right, that is what I did. It, it reminds me of what I did more wow. than anything and I'm like, oh right, like yeah, that's my yeah. punch. And I even I even see things that I learned in my training. You know, huh. this sort of stuff and this stuff, like it's and that, that was, stuff. That was impressive. That, you they put you in there. Yeah, I mean. They're could, using some of Ollie's stuff today. It's not quite the same when he does it. I'm just gonna say. You must have trained a bit. Yeah, that. we go to the same guy. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Do you have a final word for <laughs> our viewers, maybe anyone in Korea who's thinking about watching this film yes. coming out? Well, definitely watch the film. Go take everyone and tell these guys to feed me. Stuff. Please, if yeah. you if you ever come to Korea, we to. have plenty of food we'd love to show you. Yes, and, uh, please. Fantastic. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank we really you. appreciate it. Me too. It's lovely to meet you. Nice to meet you. Thank you so much for your time.